Ryan's gone missing again. Every time he does it, I have to go searching for him. Ryan! He normally answers if I call him. Ryan! He's not coming up the river. Ryan! Where he's gone? Ryan! Oh, I heard a goose. Well, I've been looking for Ryan everywhere and one of my neighbours just phoned up and found him in the middle of a field over here somewhere. He said his dog chased him. He took off, but he landed again. He's meant to be over here somewhere, so... Me and Wayne are going to find him. We're going to ride him back. <laughs> he's over here somewhere. He is like a dragon. Huh? He's in the middle of that field, I reckon. There's people with him. No, that one doesn't lift up. You have to put your leg over it. There he is, look, they found him. I know, he's a bloody nightmare. Hello, mate. Here he is. Here he is. Where have you been? You've been gone for hours. Where you been? Hello, how are you? Yeah, we're all good now. You're okay. It's all right. Well done. You've got to walk back now. Come on, keep up. Come on. Goose. Because the wind's blowing the other way, he won't take off, so we've got to walk all the way back. I have to clip your wings, I think. It's going to be the only safe way. That dog nearly ate you. Other dogs will eat you. You don't know about stuff. Wherever you go, we have to walk back. It takes ages, because you can't really get over four-wheel drive stuff. I might have to clip your wings, Ryan. It's a very real option, or you're gonna get eaten. Yeah? You're a good boy, but you gotta go home. Come on, keep up. Walk of shame. Come on. Right, we're home. Come on. You're a naughty, naughty goose. takes ages. If only you fly home, it'd be all right. Good kitty, kitty. Oh, you take so long, Ryan. You take so long. Where's Bando? Very sad. I'm sorry, mate, but you're gonna get eaten. I shouldn't have taught you to fly. Your brother doesn't fly, your mum and dad don't fly. And now, Wayne with the nasty clippers means you're not going to fly because you're going to get eaten. You stood in the middle of that field next door and that Alsatian nearly ripped your head off and you just stood there and looked at it. So, we're going to give you six months without flying and when you're a bit older, then you can fly. But as it stands, you can't get home and you don't know the dangers of dogs. So you're going to look a bit weird and you won't be able to fly next time you try. Sorry.